Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Swati Weapon Locating Radar is an electronic scanned phased array radar which automatically locates hostile artillery, mortars and rocket launchers and tracks friendly fire to locate the impact point of friendly artillery fire to issue the necessary correction. Recently, we have reported that Indian Army has put a proposal worth 1000 crore rupees to the Defense Ministry for buying 12 Swati weapon locating radars. At present, Indian Army is operating 22 Swati radars and 6 more orders are in progress. After the success of Swati radar and impressed with its performance, Indian Army has asked DRDO to develop a lighter version of this radar. We can call it Mini or Swati version 2. The existing version of Swati WLR is mounted on a 8x8 Tatra truck which is mobile. However, Indian Army wanted a much lighter version of Swati WLR which can be mounted on a 6x6 wheeled platform which further improves the mobility of radar on mountainous terrain where the roads are narrow and mobility is a big challenge. The new Mini Swati will feature a fixed radar array that has 90 degree view which will be mounted on a BML 6x6 truck. Even though it's smaller in size when compared to its predecessors, it is equally and even more effective in certain parameters. The radar was deployed across LSE in Ladakh and Sikkim after 2020 Indochina standoff for trials. The Army is quite satisfied with the performance of Mini Swati and is looking to procure 6 of these Mini or new version of Swati radar. This will be quite helpful in northern and northeastern frontier with China to locate their artilleries. The radar can even detect rockets launched from MBRLs. However, since rocket launchers are mobile, they may change the position after the fire. However, that's not the case with mortars and towed artilleries. They take considerable amount of time to change their position and can be countered within that period with the help of their coordinates detected and shared by Swati. The Swati detects the origin of the fire of artillery shells, mortars and rockets based on their projectile motion or trajectory. With the help of its C-band phased array radar, it is able to change the direction of its radar waves just by shifting the face of its signal electronically without physically moving the antenna. This enables Swati radar to cover wide area much quickly. It can not only track and locate the enemy fire position for artillery, mortars and rockets, but can also track the fall shot from friendly guns and provide correction to counter fire. Swati has instrumented range of 50 km with probability of detection 90%. It can operate from minus 30 degrees to plus 55 degrees Celsius. It can also operate from an altitude of 16,000 km and can be deployed within 30 minutes for action. For a 81 mm or larger motor, its detection range is between 4 to 20 km. For a 105 mm or larger guns, its detection range is 4 to 30 km. For free flight rockets, its detection range is 6 to 40 km and for 155 mm rockets or guns, its range is 30 km. It can track up to 7 targets simultaneously from different direction. The target information of up to 99 targets is presented as a high resolution multi-mode color display on ruggedized power PCs in real time and can be overlaid on a digital map. The Swati WLR can store large 100 km by 100 km digital map for display purposes. Swati is a network with artillery units through Shakti Artillery Combat Command and Control System, which in turn automates and facilitates the decision support for all the operational aspects of artillery functions from the core down to the artillery battery level in a networked environment. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. 
please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already we'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in different sector